They make beautiful glass awards for runners of the Boston Marathon. We head inside Pear Point Glass to see where they come from. Next. Cape Cast. So Ian, you're a glassmaker here in Sandwich at Pear Point. What's your connection to the marathon? Um, we make the awards for them. Nice looking pieces of work. Tell us a little bit more about them. Um, they approached us um, four years ago uh, with the oldest marathon and we're the oldest glass factory around, so we've been together ever since. How long does it take to make the order? Probably over 100 hours or so. And every year they vary a little bit and there's probably over 100 in total when we're all said and done. How do you get good at this? What's the secret? Um, just time. It takes a lot of time to get this down. Um, just time and practice and just watching and learning. So Ian, this is a 2011 award for the marathon. Break it down a little for us. Um, this is just the compote, one of the shapes that we use. Um, they vary. There's usually about eight different shapes per year. Um, but this is just one of them. Um, this would have been a compote bowl. And they didn't use this this year, but this is one of the older shapes that was just an extra. Well, Ian, you make these beautiful awards for the Boston Marathon, but there's a bit more to the story involving the tragedy that happened at the marathon last year. I understand you were there uh, because of your connection with these uh, beautiful awards. What happened up there that day? Um, we were just standing at the finish line and uh, big boom, you know, and wow, that was loud, you know, you felt the air go back and your hair blow back and, and we just said, wow, somebody famous must have gone over the finish line. So looked over thinking it was like a cannon going off or something and we saw the smoke and Next thing you know, you knew it really wasn't somebody. It wasn't it wasn't supposed to happen, and you started to see the chaos. And then the next thing you know, a couple seconds later, the next explosion happened, and it was just like this isn't right. You know, we got to get out of there. You know. How do you think about it all now? Like when you're making those things this year, was it coming back to you? Is the whole thing? How, how do you sort of work that out? Well, I've always been kind of proud to make these trophies to begin with. Um, so it kind of makes me still proud, and it makes me proud to be a part of it, you know? Just happy to be a, really a part of it, but you know, not happy what happened, but happy to, you know, contribute and, you know, do something positive, you know, for it.